The greatest inheritance we can leave for our children is not just wealth, but the wisdom to use it wisely. As we all know, the rich aren't just wealthy in their bank accounts, but also in their wisdom about money. Today we will uncover the wealth-building wisdom that has been passed down through generations of successful families. You see, the rich have a set of principles and habits they instill in their children from a young age. Imagine if you could pass on these invaluable secrets to your own children, or even adopt them for yourself. Let's get ready to unlock the vault of financial knowledge together. 1. The rich teach their children not to work for money. No matter how many books you read, attend seminars or pursue education, it all boils down to this key concept. Don't work for money, have money work for you. Poor individuals typically exchange their time for money and then spend it, while the rich leverage the money they earn to generate more money. A common misconception that keeps many people in poverty is the belief that large sums of money are necessary to start investing, making it seem unattainable. In contrast, the wealthy are always on the lookout for even the smallest opportunities to add drops to their bucket of passive income. Starting a business today can require less than $500 if you know what you're doing, or it can even be done for free if you're willing to invest time. The fundamental concept of passive income and understanding how to use money to generate more money form the bedrock of any wealth-building strategy. 2. Rich parents teach their kids having money doesn't make you a better person. Indeed, having money doesn't automatically make someone a better person. It simply helps solve certain problems. Achieving financial success often involves hard work and perseverance, not just inheritance. Along the journey to wealth, understanding the value of humility becomes crucial. Rich individuals, who likely worked diligently for their success, tend to remember their roots and the struggles they faced. Humility and respect for others are foundational values often instilled by wealthy parents in their children. One important life lesson, often realized too late, is that money can't purchase a clear conscience. While money can provide physical comforts, it doesn't address the needs of the mind and soul. True richness encompasses qualities like humility, respect, and a clear conscience, which extend beyond financial wealth. Contrary to the stereotype of wealthy individuals being snobby and arrogant, many rich people are humble and down-to-earth. 3. Solving problems is the quickest way to get rich. The rich emphasize to their children the crucial distinction between merely getting paid and achieving wealth. Poor individuals typically get paid for performing specific tasks. In contrast, the rich avoid repetitive work because it can be easily outsourced. Instead, they focus on tackling significant problems, understanding that the larger the problem they solve, the wealthier they become. Teaching children to embrace this mindset sets them on a path where they understand the value in solving substantial problems, paving the way for success. By instilling the idea that solving problems for others can lead to financial reward, the rich guide their children toward a mindset that can propel them to success in the long run. 4. The rich parent raise their children's expectations. If you want your child to have a better life than you, it's important to teach them not to settle for less and encourage them to have high expectations. Some people believe that the key to being happy is to set low expectations and meet them, but when it comes to financial success, the secret is to set high expectations and strive to achieve them. Many people choose to play it safe and settle for average results, avoiding taking big risks for potential big rewards. However, success often comes to those who aim high and are willing to take on challenges. While the competition may be tough at the top, there are fewer people competing increasing the chances of achieving significant success. 5. The rich teach their kids not to waste time on things that do not correlate to the real world. It's a reality check, but the truth is that certain degrees, like those in ethnic or gender studies, journalism, history, or other fields, may not hold significant value in the real world. The educational system appears to be out of touch, repeating outdated information without considering its practical relevance for the future, accumulating massive debt for skills that don't directly align with the current job market can be a challenging investment. The lesson here is that dedicating your time to areas that apply to the real world and areas that you're truly passionate about, 
and mastering them independently might offer a better chance of success than relying on conventional degrees. Imagine lending substantial amounts of money to graduates when the jobs for which they are being educated may no longer exist. 6. Wealthy parents impart to their children the notion that money serves as a tool. Money is often misunderstood and wrongly demonized, with some people asserting that it is the root of all evil. Consider the individuals who typically make such statements. How successful and happy are they in their lives? Poor individuals often blame their misfortunes on a lack of money and associate negativity with the concept of wealth. Even when they acquire money, it tends to lead to more problems that they struggle to address. Contrastingly, the rich view money as a tool, a neutral resource that can be utilized to navigate life. Money is essentially pieces of paper and plastic with drawings on them, exchanged for material value. It is neither inherently good nor evil. The wealthy stop taking money personally and recognize it for what it is, an instrument to improve their lives. This perspective is akin to viewing money as a tool, much like scissors. You can use scissors to cut hair or choose to harm yourself by stabbing your eye. The latter, of course, is an irrational choice. Similarly, once you start thinking of money as a tool, the game changes and you cease harming yourself with it. 7. The rich teach. Their children knowledge is more valuable than money. Invest in yourself. It pays the best dividends, suggests that true value lies in self-improvement. However, this goes beyond traditional education. It is about increasing one's value to the world. Unfortunately, the concept of becoming a valuable individual is not commonly taught to children, especially by those with a poor mindset. However, wealthy individuals emphasize this idea as their children grow, recognizing the higher probability of success and happiness associated with being valuable. The rich often expose their children to various activities early on, aiming to give them a head start on accumulating the necessary hours to master valuable skills. Knowledgeable individuals consistently demonstrate their ability to generate money because they offer value to the marketplace. 8. The rich make their children understand there is always more money. A crucial mindset held by the wealthy is the belief that there is always more money. While many people think of money as finite and feel constrained by their financial circumstances, the rich understand that opportunities to acquire more money are abundant. Whether it's funding a new business venture or enjoying a vacation, the wealthy recognize that money is plentiful and their task is to pursue it. The wealthy operate with an abundant mindset, understanding that there is no limit to their earning potential and that money is waiting for them to attract it. This mindset plays a significant role in financial decision-making. While many people focus on saving money and reducing expenses, the rich prioritize increasing their income. This doesn't mean they ignore cost-cutting, but they invest more time and energy into expanding their cash flow rather than focusing solely on trimming minor expenses. 9. Wealthy parents impart the wisdom of using debt prudently to their children. Understanding the difference between good debt and bad debt can be a key to financial success. Bad debt tends to make you poorer, while good debt has the potential to make you richer. This is a lesson that many rich individuals have learned over time, but it might not have been explicitly taught to you while growing up. People who end up with less wealth often borrow money for things like a new car, a phone, or basic necessities. Essentially, they spend borrowed money on liabilities. While the rich understand debt, they strategically borrow money with the intent of using it to generate more money. This is where the concept of good debt comes in. Successful individuals have mastered this art of using good debt to fund projects that contribute to their financial growth and pass down the same advice to their children at a young age. By instilling these invaluable lessons in our children, we're not only shaping their financial future, but also empowering them to lead fulfilling lives where they can make a positive impact on the world around them. Remember, true wealth lies not only in the dollars and cents, but also in the wisdom and values we impart to the next generation. Before we conclude this video, I'd love to hear your thoughts. If you'd like to share, please feel free to drop a comment. I hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed creating it. As always, I wish you a beautiful day. Take care.